This video starts by the way, if any of my co-workers of Domino's end up actually seeing this, then they will have to realize that the guy I'm talking about doesn't even work there anymore, so don't think I'm talking about you, insert person here. So anyway, now that we got that out of the way, I'll begin the story. So this is about how this guy might as well have been Little Zan's biggest stan, biggest fan, but if you don't know who he is, just look him up. He's this rapper who... He does, like, Xanax and opioids or something, I don't know, but he literally just has, like, a video that I tried to react to a while ago, but it somehow got blocked worldwide, I don't even know why, and I also even tried to upload another reaction video today, but guess what, it also got blocked worldwide, so I don't know why, because literally what YouTube's doing is against the law, and I even saw other people react to this certain guy, this certain rapper, so this is fucking stupid, and anyway... I just had to get that off my chest real quick. So, this guy, um, he just matched Little Xan almost to a T. It was so weird. I mean, he kind of cut his hair like the guy did. He sort of talked like he did, you know, just the way he talked. He was like, oh, and you know, stuff like that. It was weird. Just the way he talks. Um, he just talked really lazily. He was probably around the same height as he was. Little Xan also wears white a lot. This guy would always wear a white sweatshirt under his work uniform and stuff and uh, this guy I don't know if he does Xanax but I don't know what he does at all I've seen him vape before but other than that I don't know what if he does any drugs or anything but um, I just know about that so he also just about every time probably nine times out of ten maybe even ten times out of ten when I walked into the work he'd always be playing Little Xan's music and the thing was he had the day shift Pretty much where he would come in like an hour or two before the store opens just to get everything all set up ready for work and then he would um, end up coming in um, and leaving when I was about to leave or like an hour or two before I did so yeah basically he would just always have it I think I've heard the song be trade so many times that I probably could memorize all the lyrics at this point um, it's just really goofy and I mean Literally, I think it goes something like Zane's don't take you, Zane's gonna fake you, Zane's gonna betray you, something about her pussy tastes like Skittles, I don't even know, it's a weird song, I'd have to probably listen to the whole thing to refresh my memory, but I just remember those are some of the lyrics and he just says stuff like that a lot or whatever, um, but anyway, yeah, he pretty much just looked, talked, and acted like him, and another thing that I learned from a YouTuber, his name is Sunny V 2 you should probably check out his uh, content, he makes cool videos, he sort of does a lot of things, it's like, I think one of the recent ones he did was like, the downfall of Pizza Hut, and um, he d either does like stuff about a musician, something about why, insert this guy, rapper career failed, or insert YouTuber here, why they failed, or whatever, um, but anyway, yeah, pretty much that was what he did, um, and one of the things he said was, um, he talked about how Lil Xan, actually failed all of his classes a bunch of times and dropped out freshman year and this guy did the same thing he failed all of his classes and then dropped out freshman year at the age of 17 so yeah that's kind of sad i mean um i'm not the smartest person in the world you know i'm not albert einstein but you know at least i completed high school before trying to get a job and stuff so yeah this is really goofy and ridiculous so I just wanted to make this video real quick talking about how this guy is like Little Zan's biggest stan and he would probably fucking, I don't know, suck a dick to be him for two seconds. I may or may not have stolen that um, little quip thing from Eminem roasting Machine Gun Kelly. So anyways, have a good day everybody and I'll see you guys later.